Have any of you heard this story before? A spiritually aware high school student which has lost a parent to evil spirits in his life is plagued with seeing spirits himself and is ultimately brought into contact with a powerful female spirit who also kills evil spirits to maintain balance? Well, have you heard the part about whenever they come into contact shortly after a powerful spirit rises and attacks which ends up to them greatly wounding that very spiritually aware person which then leads them to take power from that female spirit so that he can protect the others around him? Well, if you have, you're probably thinking about Bleach, a once popular series which fell off for many years before recently resurging with the final animated arc. And you'd be right overall if this video was about Bleach. So what is this video about? Well, News Exorcist, a weekly shonen manga which is released this year in May of 2023. Currently, this manga series has one volume released as of October. This manga is being published simultaneously in English and Japanese, so you never have to worry about long waits for the translated chapters. Currently, there are 25 chapters to sift through, with another due in a week from this video. Now, let's dive on in and look at News Exorcist. First of all, this is our protagonist, Gakuro Yajime. Uh, Yajima? I don't know how to pronounce it. It's not in an anime yet. He is a high school student who can see spirits naturally. He has a troubled past with these spirits, which makes him very timid and non-confrontational. We quickly learn that the reason is due to a spirit killing his father when he was just a child. And here we have the titular entity New, a powerful spiritual entity which has been sealed for a long time and also hasn't had any contact with anyone living for over 60 years. She loves humanity and kills the evil spirits when she can to ensure that the high school is not overrun with these evil spirits who would seek to harm humanity, which she seemingly cherishes as she loves what humans have created, reveling in the media and games produced by humans. Yajima encounters the spirit on his way to eat on the roof after he willingly offered up his services as a lackey when school bullies, uh, uh, bullies attempted to secure his classmate Zeno as one instead. Upon finding a broken talisman on his way to the roof so that he could eat his lunch, thinking it was the roof access door, a large ghost instead burst out of it. This instantly reminds him about how his father had died in front of him due to a ghost attacking. Though, this spirit is purged, preventing his demise by New, who he recognized instantly as a spirit. New brings him in to her sealed room and gets to know him by playing video games with him. While playing video games, New finally explains that smaller spirits can merge together to become even more powerful spirits, which are then capable of being seen by and hurting humans. She thusly quickly offers to form a partnership so that Yajima can kill the spirits with her power. Yajima begins to tremble, stating he can't accept a spirit's power. His father was killed by a spirit, and he just doesn't sit right with that. Meanwhile, Zeno confronts the bullies head on after he overhears them badmouthing Yajima. And soon after, Yajima returns from lunch break to the classroom to see a battered and near naked Zeno. The bullies quickly turn to Yajima with intent for him to be their next victim, when all of the manifested spirits from the negativity begin to merge. Within an instant, the spirit manifests, removing the bully's arm as we see he was about to punch Yajima. This puts the entire class into turmoil. Yet, due to his trauma, Yajima is experiencing one of the three Fs as he is seen freezing in place and watching as Zeno rescues one of the bullies. Zeno stands up to the spirit, having Yajima recall what happened to his father, who once did the same, standing up to a spirit. His last words were about being strong. Watching Zeno take a blow, he finally breaks through the freezing and jumps, preventing Zeno from a death blow which is followed up, and soon is wounded by the attack severely. He explains why he did it, as he saw both Zeno and his father as strong, and he too wished to be strong. With his resolve finally stated, New appears, stating she could only watch until now as the spirit clone of herself, which she had placed on Yajima's shoulder, took time to manifest. 
She once again offers power to Yajima after st stating how brave he and Zeno are. This time, with the choice that she can either take him and Zeno and everyone else to safety, or instead give Yajima the strength he needs to become powerful to defeat the spirit himself. Of course, Yajima, the hero of the story, chooses power so that he can defeat the spirit himself. And within an instant, he is transformed, hearing new state, she will raise him to be the strongest to save everyone. Yajima begins combat, at first confused how to fight the spirit until Newt reminds him he should probably use his new spiritual weapon, a sword. With a swing of his mighty sword, he destroys the spirit and the classroom, much to Newt's surprise that his power has gotten a bit too strong with her aid. The next day, everything is seen to be back to normal, which shocks Yajima, as he can't really recall what happened after he defeated that spirit. Here we learn, however, that when Yajima is on campus, Nyu can use a clone to freely roam the campus now. Questioning if it was instead her that cleaned up the campus, we learn now that there is actually a group of powerful, spiritually aware people known as exorcists. These operate secretly within the very town they reside in, keeping spirits at bay. At, they, have a, they have a shortage of exorcists, though. Now, the two then go up and play some card games. New explains that the tool which was actually gathering the spirits had finally broke after reaching its limits. This tool, which was broken and was the mass that was seen in the first chapter, was acting as a talisman. New states that there will probably be an upsurge in spiritual activity now and that she'll need him to defeat the spirits on campus. Though he can't use that power too much yet, as it will wear him down and he'll definitely need to take breaks after using it. Yet, back in class, New poses as his stepsister and the class is betaken by her natural beauty. Though the discussions are ended when the clearly possessed teacher walks in demanding to know what new is. He lunges, but is stopped by Yajima and the other boys who push him against the wall. Except it was the window, and they ended up tossing him and Yajima out of it. Accidentally, of course, you know, not on purpose, they're not trying to kill Yajima. Using his power in this freefall, Yajima eliminates the spirit and new saves the teacher. The class then celebrates Yajima as a hero with newfound respect when he is pulled into New's breast as he begins to pass out. He awakens in New's lap in her room as she pats his head. She explains that physical contact is actually needed to replenish his spiritual power and that his output is massive, so they'll need to do this every time he uses it. After some time, Yajima is sent to help others who have spirits plaguing them. He recounts that recently he helped a young girl who then asked him to come to lunch with her after he dispelled the spirit which plagued her. New remarks about his flowing start of youth is upon him, and he's kind of surprised at this and shows that he has a lack of self-esteem, uh, self stating that if he was a girl, he wouldn't even date himself. At lunch, however, the girl from earlier in the day meets up with him, expressing a want to make an occult club. New uses Yajima's voice and agrees to this, and upon leaving, Yajima catches a panty shot and is promptly hit, in, uh, hit with a forgetting beam attack, which, of course, this is manga and it isn't really explained yet if he actually forgot or not was new being present. Upon searching the school, they find an empty room where the girl opens it. She is briefly assaulted by a spirit, but it is quickly ended as Yajima steps in and eliminates it. He has now resolved fully to make this occult club of his own volition, and as he's discussing the want to find a nice room, a spirit manifests behind him, yet it is promptly eliminated by the girl herself. Here we have Kazusa Su. She's an exorcist, which is convenient being new had recently stated Yajima to befriend a good exorcist. She explains that exorcists can don special soul gear, which makes them invisible to people so that they can handle spirits discreetly. However, prior to this reveal, Nu announces her human name is Sayoko, and after checking in on the two, she meets the exorcist herself. After that meeting, donning her soul gear, she leads Yajima into the hallway where they encounter a level 2 spirit. Now the phrase level 2 spirit obviously doesn't mean anything to you right now. 
but level 2 spirits are actually a collection of 16 level 1 spirits, and are quite rare as not many spirits can actually merge with one another. These spirits are the ones which physically manifest to humans and can also physically hurt them as seen prior in the very first chapter amid the classroom incident. She then begins to fight this beast as a weakened Yajima mostly watches the battle, surprised at how fast she is and what she can do, until he sees something that she doesn't and an instinct activates his power and lunges into battle as the spirit crashes outside of the school. She happily watches as he defeats the spirit, stating he passes. What he doesn't know yet, but he passes. Hours later, we learn that at Exorcist HQ, Sue requests to partner up with Yajima as a means to handle the uprising in spirits in the area as the exorcists are actually experiencing a labor shortage. Surprised, her superior acknowledges her growth and allows her to partner with our new hero, of course, to keep the high school safe from the spiritual uprising. And this has been a recap of the first four chapters of News Exorcist. Now, I do plan on making some more videos on this manga, so if you wanted more of this, there will be more. If you didn't want more, oh well, I apologize. I hope you will still come and support me nonetheless. So be sure to comment below, do you think this manga has long-term appeal, and is this the modern Bleach? Let me know your opinions on this manga, and if you've even read it. I hope you have a good day, a good night, and remember to have some fun. I'm Protector Cross, and I'm signing off.